denouncing the election as a scam. Flooding the streets of Algiers on Wednesday, the eve of the vote, hundreds of protesters called out for a complete overhaul of the political system, decrying the upcoming polls as a charade and a regurgitation of an old regime. We want elections with our rules, not elections to recycle Bouteflika's regime, which has stolen the country and people's goods for 20 years. The election is shaping up to be a pivotal moment in a struggle lasting just under a year between the network of military security and political leaders and a leaderless street protest movement. Those maintaining power have cast the election as the only way to end the stalemate on the streets. The protesters, meanwhile, reject it as a sham designed to maintain the status quo. The five approved candidates all either supported the controversial and long-standing former president Bouteflika or participated in his government, including two as prime ministers. I won't vote because these elections themselves are a betrayal. Everyone who votes is committing a betrayal against our country because the summit of stupidity is to try the same experience with the same people and tools and expect a different result. Wednesday also marked the anniversary of the outbreak of major demonstrations against French colonial powers in Algeria in 1960, with calls online urging protesters to converge on the Algiers Square in commemoration. Police then used truncheons to hold them back near the central post office, the rallying point of the Hirak anti-government protest movement since February.